here we have our droppers and they contain our urine sample. We use the droppers that came with the pregnancy test to withdraw the urine. In this top dropper, we have urine that contains HCG. And how I know that is because it's my urine and I'm pregnant. This bottom dropper contains urine that does not have HCG in it. It comes from my husband, so he shouldn't have HCG in his urine. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna add three drops of urine to each test. So we'll add to this top one. This is the urine that has the HCG. So one, two, three. And then we'll add drop here. One, two, three. And we're gonna let that go for three minutes because for this particular test, they say to wait three minutes to read the results, but don't read the results after five minutes because they won't be valid. So it's been three minutes, now we're gonna interpret our results. So as you can see, here in these tests, we have a line in both of the control areas. This tells us we added enough urine and that this test is working. However, in this pregnancy test here on the top, there is a line in the test area. So it's positive, which tells us that it detected HCG in the urine. However, here on the bottom, this bottom pregnancy test, there is no line in this test area. So it is negative. It tells us that it did not detect HCG in that urine sample.